All right, welcome everyone. I am Sam. This is a 45 minute vinyasa two. Today's class is going to be a rhythmic flow. We are going to move to the flow of our breath, the rhythm of our breath. I'm also going to be adding some repetitive movement into there so that we can really use it to synchronize our body and our mind through our movement and breath. This is my favorite way to practice by really looping our mind into the movement and the breath and our body. It allows our practice to become a moving meditation. That being said, we are going to pretty much be moving for the next 45 minutes. So I really encourage you to take breaks whenever needed. Just listen to your body and just make this practice your own. Have fun. When you're ready, we're going to get started in child's pose. So walking towards the back of your mat, coming into your child's pose. So however that looks to you, you can have your knees together or apart, draping your upper body over your thighs or between your thighs and then arms forward or arms down by your side, whatever feels good to you. And take a moment there once you've landed just to settle. Allow your body to soften into the shape. And just arrive on your mat, feel the ground beneath you. Feel the support of the earth as you rest your body. And then start to turn your attention inwards, doing a little body scan, noticing how you're feeling in your physical body, how you're feeling mentally, energetically, and just start to cultivate the direction you want to take this practice. In. And then begin to place your attention behind the flow of your breath really dropping in and just noticing the movement of air as it comes in and out of your body. Without forcing anything, start to draw in a little deeper inhales and let your exhales be complete. Empty your lungs completely. If it's a part of your practice, start to connect to that ujjayi breath, that audible inhale and audible exhale, moving the breath across the back of your throat, creating that oceanic sound. And most importantly, just creating a breath that will support and guide you through this practice. And before we start to flow, take a moment here just to set an intention for your practice thinking about what it is that brought you to your mat this morning, what it is you want to get out of this practice, the qualities you want to infuse, to embody, placing that here so that you can draw those, bring those qualities into the practice, into the movement. As you are, take another deep breath in. Really long breath out, empty your lungs completely. If your arms are backwards, start to sweep your arms forward, press through your palms, and really gently draw yourself up onto hands and knees, tabletop position. Follow your inhale as you come up, and then drop your belly, lift your head, lift your chest, tailbone high to the sky. As you exhale, tuck your toes under, shift your hips up and back, coming into a downward facing dog. Pedal your knees a little bit, press your feet down into the mat, and then inhale, breath, shift forward into plank. Exhale, breath gently, drop your knees down to the mat, press your hips back to your heels, back to your child's pose, drape your upper body over your thighs. Inhale, hands and knees. As you rise, drop your belly, lift your head, lift your chest, tailbone high. Exhale, tuck your toes, shift your hips up and back, downward facing dog. Inhale, draws you forward into plank pose, shoulders come over your wrists. Gentle drop of your knees down to the mat. Press your hips to your heels as you exhale. We'll do that two more times. Flow to your breath. Inhale, rise up. Belly drops, head, chest, tail lifts high. Exhale, tuck your toes, shift your hips up and back. Downward facing dog. Plank pose as you breathe in. Draw your heart forward. Think about the heart going through your arms. Drop your knees down to the mat. Press your hips to your heels as you exhale, child's pose. One more. Inhale, tabletop. Belly drops, head, chest, tail high. Exhale, downward facing dog. 
plank pose as you breathe and pull your heart forward, long spine. Drop your knees down, press your hips to your heels, child's pose as you breathe out. Hold it here. Full breath in, fill all the way up. Long breath out. Press down into your palms, come up onto tabletop, hands and knees. Shoulders over your wrists, hips over your knees. Press down through the left palm of your hand and as you inhale, sweep your right arm to the sky. Stay with me, we're gonna take some movement before we land. As you exhale, weave the right arm underneath the left, but don't lower all the way down. Inhale, rise back up, reach your right arm high. Exhale to weave. One more, inhale, reach. This time as you exhale, weave the right arm under, lower to the right shoulder, right temple, and then take any variation with your left arm that feels good. You can walk it forward or drape it behind your back. Allow yourself to land here, feel sensation. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Left hand underneath the shoulders, press into your palms. Inhale, rise back up, right arm back up to the sky, reach through your fingertips. And then right arm meets, the right hand meets the left, tabletop position. Make any adjustments that are needed. Press down through the right palm of your hand. Inhale, reach the left arm high. Exhale, weave, hover your left shoulder. Inhale, rise back up. Exhale to weave. Last one, inhale, reach. Exhale, weave, this time lower all the way down. Any variation with the right arm. Find that sweet spot, the place where you feel sensation and breathe into it. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Right hand underneath your shoulder, press yourself up. Inhale, reach your left arm to the sky. And then exhale, left hand meets your right. Inhale, drop your belly, lift your head, lift your chest, tailbone high, hold it here. Tuck your toes under, shift your hips up and back, downward facing dog. Take a deep breath in. Exhale and press your hands and your feet down into the mat as you breathe out. Bring your big toes together to touch. Inhale, sweep the left or right leg high to the sky, breathe in. Exhale, steps your right foot between your hands. Stay in your runner's lunge, back knee stays lifted. Tint your palms, come up onto your fingertips. As you inhale, drop your hips down low, lift your heart up high into a lunging cow. As you exhale, squeeze your front leg straight and fold. To your breath, inhale, bend back through your front knee, pull your heart forward. Exhale, squeeze your front leg straight and fold. One more, inhale, come forward, heart forward, long spine. Exhale, squeeze your front leg straight, fold, hold it here. Press your feet down into the mat, lift your torso halfway, breathe in, pull your heart forward. Bow a little deeper as you exhale. Hold it here as you breathe in. Soften into the pose as you breathe out. Inhale, bend back through your front knee. Left hand to the inside of your right foot, right arm reaches towards the sky as you exhale. As you inhale, extend your right arm alongside your head, pinky down, thumb up, reach through your fingertips, take another inhale. Exhale, right hand down to the mat, standing forward fold, left foot meets your right. Flat back, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bow, release. Inhale, stand up, sweep up, big breath in. Hands to your heart as you breathe out. Arms reach to the sky, inhale. Draw your elbows down, goal post your arms, lift your chest high as you exhale. Inhale, reach your arms up high. Exhale, bow forward over your legs. Flat back, inhale, lengthen, long spine. Now as you exhale, hands down to the mat, step your left foot to the back of the mat. Plant your palms down firmly. Inhale, three-legged dog, right leg up and back, breathe in. Knee to your nose as you breathe out. Press your palms round your spine. Inhale, right leg high. Again, knee to nose, exhale. Inhale, right leg back. 
One more time, knee to nose, exhale. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Downward facing dog as you exhale. Inhale, shift forward into plank. Slow exhale, lower all the way down to your belly. Untuck your toes, press the tops of your feet down, baby cobra, inhale, lift your head, your chest, breathe in. Exhale, bow, release, let it go, breathe out. Tuck your toes, lift your knees, belly to spine, option to come to hands and knees, or inhale, plank. Downward facing dog as you exhale. Really nice, you guys, take a deep breath in. And a long breath out. Big toes come together to touch. Inhale, reach the left leg high, breathe in. Exhale, steps the left foot between your hands. Allow yourself a moment just to land. Tint your palms, come up onto your fingertips. Take a breath in, let the hips dip low, reach your heart up high. Exhale, squeeze your front leg straight, fold. To your breath, inhale, bend back through your front knee. Think about lengthening your spine. Exhale, squeeze and fold. One more inhale to come forward. Exhale, legs straight and bow. Keep the legs straight, strong. Inhale, lift your torso, lengthen. Exhale, find your depth, release. Hold it here as you breathe in. Soften as you breathe out. Inhale, bend back through your front knee. So you exhale, right hand to the inside of your left foot, left arm reaches towards the sky. Roll your shoulders open, and then inhale, reach your left arm alongside your head, reach to the fingertips. Think about lengthening from your fingertips through your back heel. And then exhale, left hand down to the mat, standing forward fold, right foot meets your left. Inhale, lengthen long spine. Exhale, bow, release. Root to rise, sweep your arms, reach high. Hands to heart as you exhale. Inhale, arms reach high. Draw your elbows down, go post your arms, lift your chest. Inhale, reach. Exhale, bow. Flat back, inhale, lengthen long spine. This time as you exhale, hands down to the mat, step your right foot back. Plant the palms down. Inhale, three-legged dog, left leg high, breathe in. Knee to your nose, breathe out. Inhale back. Knee to nose, exhale. Inhale, left leg high. Last time here, knee to nose, exhale, top. Left leg back, breathe in. Downward facing dog, breathe out. And you always have the option just to stay here or you're with me, inhale, plank pose. Exhale, lower. Upward facing dog, low cobra, big breath in. Downward facing dog as you breathe out. Take a breath in. And a breath out. Reconnect, come back to your breath again and again and again. We come back to the experience of breathing, being in our body. As you inhale, lift your heels up high. Drop both heels to the right side of your mat as you exhale. Inhale, lift the heels high. Both heels to the left, exhale. Inhale, come high up onto your toes. This time as you exhale, bend your knees, look forward. Step, walk, or float. Top of your mat, nice Helen. Flat back, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bow, release. Inhale, stand up, sweep up, big breath in. Hands to heart, feel your center, breath out. Chair pose, Ukatasana, drop your hips down, reach your arms up high, big breath in to rise. Exhale, sit your hips a little lower, find that edge. Take a breath in here, lift the chest. Open arm twist to the right, right arm sweeps back, left arm forward. Back to center, breathe in. Open arm twist to the left, breathe out. Inhale, chair pose. Bring your hands behind your back, interlock your fingers. Take a breath in, lift your chest. Exhale, straighten your legs and fold. Rinse your shoulders out. Shake your head, yes, breathe in. Shake your head, no, breathe out. Another inhale as you are. 
Gentle release of your hands down to the mat as you exhale. Flat back, inhale, lengthen, stay with me here. Hands down to the mat, step your right foot to the back of the mat. Now plant the palms, spin to the outer edge of your right foot, side plank, left foot stacks on top of right. You can always drop the right knee down for a modification. Take a breath in, reach through the left fingertips. As you exhale, you're gonna weave left arm underneath right side body. Inhale, reach. Exhale, weave. One more, inhale, reach. Exhale, weave. With control, left arm to the sky, breathe in. Plank pose to chaturanga as you breathe out. Beautiful, upward facing dog, inhale. Downward facing dog, exhale. Bring your big toes to touch. Inhale, reach your right leg high, breathe in. One time, knee to nose, breathe out. Inhale, right leg back. Exhale, steps your right foot between your hands. Crescent lunge this time, inhale, stand on your legs, reach your arms up high. Use your exhale to settle into the pose. Now here, really think about stabilizing. Press your front heel down, engage the left glute, press back through your left heel, and then pull your belly in towards your spine. Okay, this is gonna get a little challenging on our balance. Take a breath in. As you exhale, you're gonna squeeze your legs straight, draw your elbows down, Lift your chest up high. Nice, you guys. Inhale, back to crescent lunge. Exhale, legs straight, elbows down, chest high. One more, inhale. And exhale. Back to crescent lunge, breathe in. Open arm twist to the right, breathe out. Relax your shoulders down. Reach through your fingertips. Take a deep inhale. With control, warrior two, windmill your arms open as you exhale. Take a moment just to settle into your legs, press your feet down, relax your shoulders. Now next, inhale, squeeze your front leg straight, arms up, palms touch, reach to your fingertips. Back to warrior two, exhale. Inhale, legs straight, arms up, reach. Warrior two, exhale. One more, inhale, reach, lengthen, warrior two, exhale, hold it here. Keep your legs just as they are. As you inhale, just bring your arms up alongside your head, grab your right wrist with your left hand, and as you exhale, lean your upper body to the back of your mat. Think about lunging forward just a little more through your right knee. Breathe, another deep breath in. Warrior two as you breathe out. Now inhale, squeeze your front leg straight. You might wanna toe heel your back foot in a little bit, shorten the stance. Lean forward, reach to the right fingertips. Right arm down, left arm to the sky. Triangle pose, trikonasana. Roll your shoulders back. Strong activation through your legs. Breathe. Next, inhale, bend back through your front knee, reverse your warrior, big breath in, reach back as far as you can. Exhale, windmill your hands down to the mat, turn onto your toes, standing forward fold, left foot meets your right. Let yourself hang for just a moment, pedal your knees, shift your hips. Flat back, inhale, lengthen, long spine. Exhale, bow, release. Inhale, stand up, sweep up, big breath in. Hands to your heart, breath out. Chair pose, hips low, arms high, breathe in. Open arm twist to the left, left arm back, right arm forward, breathe out. Inhale, chair. Exhale to the right. Chair pose, breathe in. Hands behind your back, interlock your fingers, breathe out. Big breath in, lift your chest. Exhale, straighten your legs and fold. Release your head, release your neck. Take a deep breath in. Gentle release of your hands down to the mat as you breathe out. Feel that release through your shoulders. Maybe roll them a little bit. 
flat back. Inhale, lengthen long spine. This time, hands down, left foot steps to the back of your mat. Plant the left palm, spin to the outer edge of your left foot, side plank. Your variation, that can be dropping the knees, staggering your feet. Reach to the right fingertips as you breathe in. Weave right arm underneath left side body as you breathe out. Inhale, reach. Exhale, weave. One more, inhale. Weave as you exhale. With so much control, right arm to the sky, breathe in. Plank pose to chaturanga, or you can skip it, downward facing dog. Inhale, upward facing dog. Downward facing dog as you exhale. Really nice, deep breath in. Deep breath out. Big toes come together to touch. Left leg to the sky, inhale. Knee to your nose one time, exhale. Inhale, left leg back. Exhale, step to your left foot between your hands. Take your time, steady through the legs. Inhale, rise up, crescent lunge. Exhale, settle in. Breathe. Okay, you find the stability. Feel your foundation below you. Feel that support. Take an inhale, reach to your fingertips. Exhale, squeeze your front leg straight. Draw your elbows down, lift your chest. Really nice. Inhale, crescent lunge. Exhale, legs straight, heart opens. Woo! Crescent lunge, breathe in. Elbows down, legs straight, lift the chest, breathe out, beautiful you guys. Back to crescent lunge as you inhale. Open arm twist to the left as you exhale. All right, notice that tendency to kind of reach forward. See if you can keep your shoulders over your hips, relax your shoulders, breathe. Take a deep breath in. With control, warrior two as you breathe out. Allow yourself a moment just to land. Okay, feel the pose in your body. Reconnect with your breath. Inhale, front leg straight, arms up, reach. Warrior two, exhale. Two more, inhale. Warrior two, exhale. One more, inhale. Back to warrior two, maybe go a little deeper. Hold it there, legs stay the same. Arms overhead, breathe in. Grab the left wrist, lean your upper body to the back of the mat, breathe out. Think about breathing space into your left side body. Take a breath in. Back to warrior two as you breathe out. Inhale, squeeze your front leg straight. Maybe toe heel that back foot in a little bit. Hinge forward, reach. Left arm down, right arm high. Roll your shoulders open. Nice. Breathe. Press your feet down. Activate strong through your legs. Think about pulling your heart forward. Next, inhale. Bend back through your front knee. Reverse your warrior. Big breath in. Reach back. Exhale. Windmill your hands down to the mat. Turn onto your toes. Standing forward fold. Right foot meets your left. Flat back. Inhale. Lengthen. Exhale. Bow release. Let yourself just hang back to your body. Notice any tension. Let me see if you can start to breathe, move into it. Next, inhale, drop your hips down low, lift your arms up high, chair pose, big breath in. As you exhale, draw your hands to your heart as you breathe out. Now you're going to shift your weight into your right leg. Okay, stand all the way up, left knee draws high up into your chest. Take a breath in. Warrior three as you breathe out. Hands can stay at your heart or you can sweep them back along your sides or forward. Press down into your right heel. Inhale, come back up, standing leg raise. Left knee to your chest, breathe in. Back to warrior three as you breathe out. Nice, you guys. One more time with control. Inhale, stand back up, left knee high, breathe in. Warrior three as you breathe out. Hold it here, steady gaze. As you inhale, draw your heart forward towards your thumbs. Think about lengthening. Right hand down to the mat, left arm to the sky, half moon pose as you exhale. 
Stack your left hip on top of your right and think about lifting up, out, and away through the left side of your body. Flex your left foot, extend through your heel. Breathe. Steady gaze. Take a full breath in as you are. Exhale, left hand down to the mat. Square your hips, standing splits. Forehead draws towards your right shin. Crown of your head drops down towards the mat. Maybe lift your left leg a little higher. Take another full inhale. Standing forward, fold, release, exhale. Flat back, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bow, release. Back to chair pose, drop your hips down low, reach your arms up high, breathe in. Draw your hands to your heart, breathe out. Before we go to the other side, we're gonna take a twist. Lift your chest to your thumbs as you inhale. Think about lengthening your spine. Left elbow hooks the outside of your right thigh as you exhale. Press your hips down low, press your palms together. See if you can bring your thumbs towards the center of your chest. And then think about pulling your heart forward towards the front of your mat. Notice that that left knee is playing out in front of your right. Drop back in line and breathe. If you want to extend and open, you can open your arms. Otherwise, keep your hands at your heart. Finding your fullest expression of this pose, whatever that looks like to you in this moment. Take another inhale. Bow forward, release. Let it go, exhale. Toe heel your feet about hip width distance apart. Take your peace fingers, grab onto your big toes. As you inhale, lift your torso, lengthen. Exhale, bow. Splay your elbows out towards the sides, chest towards your thighs, and knees can be really bent here. Notice if you're clenching through your neck. See if you can create a little space between your shoulders and your ears. Maybe shake your head a little side to side. Another breath in. Another breath out. Gently release your toes. Toe heel your feet back together. Inhale into your chair pose. Drop your hips down low. Lift your arms up high. Big breath in as you rise. That arriving breath in. And then draw your hands to your heart as you breathe out. This time we bring the weight into the left leg. Inhale, stand all the way up. Right knee hugs into our chest. Take a breath in. Warrior three. Any variation with the arms as you like as you breathe out. Press down through your left heel. Inhale, stand all the way up. Right knee into your chest. Breathe in. Warrior three as you breathe out. Last time, inhale, stand up. Back to warrior three as you exhale. Hold it here, anchor and steady through your left leg. Activate through your right. Draw your heart towards your thumbs. Think about lengthening, breathe in. Half moon pose, left hand down to the mat. Right arm reaches towards the sky. Just like we did in our trikonasana, there's that tendency to let the shoulders roll forward, broaden through the collarbones. Activate through both of your legs. Think about extending through your Right heel, press back, and then steady your gaze and breathe. Okay, notice the wobbles. Notice the stability and the support of the earth. Take another breath in. Right hand back down to the mat. Square your hips, standing splits as you breathe out. Take another inhale, maybe lift your right leg a little higher, maybe not. What feels good to you, breathe in. Standing forward, fold, release, breathe out. Flat back, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bow, let go. Chair pose, drop your hips down low, reach your arms up high, inhale. Hands to your heart as you exhale. Lift your chest to your thumbs, take a breath in, hook. Right elbow to the outside of the left thigh. Okay, wherever you took this on the last side, just start to move in that direction. Take your time setting yourself up. Palms together, hearts drawing forward, knees align, steady gaze, and steady breath. 
right? We steady our gaze, we calm our mind, and then we translate that into our body. Take a deep breath in. Bow, release, let it go. Breathe out. Pedal your knees, shift your hips. From here, toe heel your feet out towards the edges of your mat, a little wider. Not wider than your mat, just a little wide. Toes out, heels in. We're setting up for Malasana squat pose. Bend your knees, sit your hips down. Press your elbows in towards your knees, hands to your heart. Lift your chest up high. Direct your tailbone down. Okay, breathe. You can close your eyes, you can stay right here. You can take it into a twist, pressing your left leg open with your left arm, plant the left palm, reach the right arm to the sky, open. Take another inhale. Back to center, hands to heart, exhale. Other side, right arm presses the right knee open, plant the palm, reach the left arm high. Take another breath in. Hands back to center as you breathe out. Everybody close your eyes. Take a full breath in. And a full breath out. Gently blink your eyes back open. You can place your hands behind you. Sit back onto your seat. Coming into cobbler's pose. Soles of your feet together. Knees come out wide. I like to take my peace fingers and grab onto my big toes. You can also just grab onto the outer edges of your feet. Take an inhale, lift your chest up high. And then as you exhale, just start to fold forward. And you might not go really far, just finding that sweet spot, right? Let your breath carry you into the space that feels right, that feels good. And then once you find that space, take a deep breath in, that arriving breath in, and then exhale, soften. Notice if you're holding any tensions in your hips. Okay, start to send breath into the spaces that feel tight. With each inhale, you give those spaces attention, right? Our bodies, when we have some sens sensations in our body, it's our body's way of asking for attention. So we give it attention by sending breath. As you are, take another deep breath in. Don't change anything. Maybe you can go just a little deeper with this exhale. Full release. And then really slowly and mindfully start to stack your spine, lift your upper body up. Come out of it really slow, really mindfully. Stay connected. And then you're gonna extend your left leg long, right sole of your foot to the left inner thigh. And we're gonna come back to that movement before we land. So you inhale, sweep your arms, reach up towards the sky. As you exhale, you're gonna fold over your left leg. Take it slow. At the end of your exhale, follow your inhale all the way back up, reach your arms back up towards the sky. You can stay right here, or right hand to the outside of your right hip. Lift your hips up high, drop your head back, open your throat. So nice, Helen. Lower your hips back down. Inhale, reach arms to the sky. Exhale, fold over your left leg. Follow your exhale all the way out. Inhale, rise back up, arms reach high. Exhale, right hand down. Lift your hips, drop your head back. Breathe in. Hips back down, breathe out. Arms reach, inhale, last time here, this time we're gonna hold it. Exhale, fold all the way over your left leg. And then I like to lift my torso, see if I can draw my heart forward just a little more, get a little longer, breathe in, and then find that full depth as I breathe out. Coming back to your breath.
Okay, notice if your mind starts to wander. It's really easy to get distracted by our thoughts. Let's see if you can drop the thoughts, come back to your breath. Right, we're aware of what's going on around us, what's going on within us, but we're not getting carried away by either. We're staying fully present with our breath, with our body. Take another deep breath in. Long breath out. Inhale, rise back up, reach your arms to the sky. Last time here, exhale, right hand down, press into the palm, lift the hips, drop your head back. Hold it here, full breath in, full breath out. One more inhale, release, let it go, exhale. And we'll switch the legs, right leg long, left sole of your foot, right inner thigh. Make any adjustments. Inhale, sweep your arms, reach up towards the sky, big breath in. Exhale, fold over your right leg, breathe out. Inhale, rise back up. Left hand to the outside of the left hip. Press down, lift your hips up high, drop your head back, breathe in. Lower your hips back down as you breathe out. Arms high, inhale. Bow forward, exhale. Bottom of your exhale, inhale, rise back up. Exhale, plant your palm, lift your hips, drop your head back. One more time with the movement, drop the hips down. Inhale, reach your arms up high. Exhale, fold forward, this time hold it here. Take an inhale, lift your torso, draw your heart forward, and then find your depth as you exhale. And just allow yourself to settle and soften and breathe. Take a deep breath in. Long breath out. With control, inhale, rise back up. Reach your arms to the sky, big breath in. Plant the left palm, lift your hips up high, drop your head back and hold here. Full breath in, full breath out. One more inhale, fill all the way up. And then release, come out of it as you exhale. Extend both legs long out in front of you. You can also bend your knees if you like your knees bent for this. Arms come out parallel to the mat, belly draws in towards the spine. So we're gonna use this for our core. Okay, start to lean back, keep the belly engaged. Gonna take it nice and slow, nice and controlled. Okay, once you feel that catch, right? Pause there for a moment, breathe. Feel it, keep breathing, don't hold your breath. Take a deep breath in. Gently release all the way down as you breathe out. It's really nice, you guys. Hug your knees in towards your chest. Give them a good squeeze in. Rock a little side to side. And then keep your knees in, but tee your arms out towards the sides. Take a deep breath in. Let your knees drop to the right and turn your gaze over your left shoulder. Close your eyes and just start to breathe up and down the length of your spine. So you inhale, follow your inhale all the way in. Think about watching it move up and down the length of your spine. Complete exhale as you breathe out. One more breath in. One more breath out. Next inhale, draw your knees back to center. Give them a good squeeze in. Pause for a moment at center just to realign your spine. 
and then knees to the left and gaze to your right. A moment to settle in and then a moment to soften in. One more breath in, one more breath out. Inhale, come back to center. Hug your knees into your chest, wrap your arms around your legs. If it feels okay on your neck, draw your forehead to your knees and just take the biggest, fullest, deepest breath that you have and hold that breath in your body and draw your knees in tight and just feel that contraction Maybe take another breath in, just a little more sip of air, and then let everything go. Final resting pose, Shavasana. Extend your legs out long, arms down by your sides. Feeling the energy and the sensation, everything moving through you and integrating into you. Just finding yourself in a place of simply being clear-minded, quiet, and letting go. Without changing anything, just bring your awareness back to your breath. Once again, start to follow your inhales all the way into your body. Follow your exhales all the way out. Now in each breath that you take to draw you deeper and deeper into a place of complete awareness, of body, of breath, of mind. And with that awareness, start to bring movement back into your body, wiggling your fingers, your toes, circling your wrist, your ankles. Eventually, arms come overhead, full body stretch. Big breath in, big decompressing breath out. And start to bend into your knees. And you'll roll yourself to your left or your right. Just take whichever side feels intuitive, feels good. Pausing there for just a moment and start to slowly make your way into a seated position. Once you land in your seat, draw your hands together in front of your heart, Anjali Mudra. Close your eyes and just a slight bow of your chin towards your fingertips in a moment to honor your practice, your presence, and your purpose. In complete gratitude, Take a deep breath in and bow as you exhale. Namaste, you guys. Namaste. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful weekend, and I will see you next time.